haven't been um, on YouTube for a while now, so I thought I would do a little cooking with me, even though I don't really cook a lot and I don't cook particularly nice food, <laughs> but I'm gonna try. So today is a Sunday, and on a Sunday you obviously need to have a nice big meal so that you can just enjoy eating on that day. So I thought I would cook a healthy-ish meal because my mom is um, not here today on the Sunday. She's um, doing some community charity work. So I thought I would just cook and show you what I'm cooking. So I'm going to set you here and I'm going to tell you what I have cooked. Maybe if I put this light on, it will be better. Okay. So I decided I'm going to cook something healthy. Something I already have in my freezer. Frozen corn. That's my that's my number one thing. I love frozen corn. And also some stir fry from McCain, like an already made stir fry. And I got the French stir fry. If there's one stir fry that I love from McCain, it's the French one because it's got carrots, um, onion, green beans, peas, mushrooms, red peppers. It's just such a like good combo of um veggies one thing that it doesn't have is corn that's why i put like that little a little tiny bit of corn in and then we're good to go the next thing i'm gonna cook is this fresh chicken not fresh because it's been frozen uh lemon and herb spiced breast fillets from bm foods so it's getting exciting what are you doing i'm usually in What is this? YouTube. No. YouTube. No, YouTube. It's a stuff with the No, don't say that. Don't worry. He's gonna go soon. No, I need to make food as well. What are you? That goes in the microwave. Timothy's making microwave lasagna and he wants to say all these things. Come show them what you're eating. I can still cook better than you. <laughs> No one asked if you can cook better than me. We should ask you what you're eating. I'm eating that. Don't you put it the other way. <laughs> it's lasagna from Woolworths. So, ingredients. A pan. I'm using this smallish pan so that I don't overeat. One of the ingredients for cooking is to know how to cook. It's not an ingredient. It's a necessary food. thing. Okay. So, this like medium sized pan. I think it's really cute. It's got polka dots, but it's been before. burned. Yeah. Is it nice? Yes. So why don't you eat it then? Why must I eat it? Because I want veggies. And no, you, you claim but you said the last... Because you had the spaghetti as well. Mommy bought two spaghetti. Because it's not daylight. You don't need this No, lighting light for my video, Timothy. Ew, now I look pale. Anyway. Now that that was finished. Just a normal nice pan. I just feel like this angle is quite ugly. Okay. I'll just hold you here for now. A pan so that I don't overeat and then I don't over feed myself. Some Zamalek. <laughs> some balsamic vinegar. Some random spices. I always put random spices. See, in you don't even know what spices I even put I put this curry powder or it's masala. No, it's curry powder. Flavorful and mild. And then I put Coleman's hot English mustard powder in there. I know these are weird spices, don't worry about it. Then pepper. Must put the toilet paper and in some salt. And then obviously olive oil for the pan. And then I got the tripod out and I tied my hair up because it's really hot. Um but I'm gonna show <laughs> I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do. I really hope that I don't set my phone on fire. Okay. Let's get cooking. Hey! Please play some music for me. Can you play some music for me so that I can mark? What are the young people of today listening to? Not this. I know, that's not this.
You know you're supposed to pause in these moments, right? No, that's why I'm in Did you pause my video? No. No, leave it there. Your selfie stick is flimsy. That's why I put on the scissor. Is it working? <laughs> Did I stop the video? I don't know. It's not going. This video's not too What does the button do? Oh, the button does nothing. Oh. Put my pan on like a medium heat. Oh, man. It's at this point where I decided I wanted a little more to the dish, you know. I didn't just want chicken and veggies. I want little breadsticks too. So I'm going to try something new. Um, Okay, insert really cool food transition in three, two, one. Oh, that was fancy. So I compiled, I buttered my breadsticks, did my chicken. My chicken is like so good. I already had some and then my veggies and like that is my lunch for today. Guess what? I'm back. And I finished my food and it was good. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to make dessert. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a chocolate um, cake. Yay! And I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to do it in the microwave. So it's going to be super easy. A quarter cup flour. Then a quarter cup sugar. And I'm sure it can be it's cool. Then two tablespoons of this cocoa powder. I'm going to add my vegetable. So it's two tablespoons of vegetable oil or coconut oil. I prefer coconut oil, but I just don't have any right now. Just pinch. an actual pinch of this baking. You can never have like any kind of thing that you bake, like a sweet thing without any vanilla essence. Just a little, a quarter cup of milk. And obviously you can add this out for yourself if you feel like the batter is salty. Mixing that in there. So good. Now what you do, you just microwave, I microwave this on high for 1 minute and 40 seconds and then I enjoy. Mm -hmm. So you guys, this is it, like, oh, look at that, like does that not look so good? Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed this chaotic, mediocre content that I have for you guys. Um,